People are still talking about this story. Many of you up and down the Florida coast from the Keys to north of Sebastian, even all the way out in the Caribbean islands, saw it in the sky. That strange light streaking toward the beach. WPTV News Channel 5's Matt Sesney looked into what it was that you saw. The video and pictures were sent to us by viewers. Something streaking in the eastern sky out over the Atlantic Tuesday night right after sunset. Barry Levine saw it from Lake Worth. It kind of looked like it was getting larger, like it was getting closer. But like I said, I didn't know. It was kind of just hanging there. Michael Wetter says he saw it in Stewart. So I called the airport and they, they said, yes, we have no idea what that was. We saw it too. To find out exactly what it was, we turned to Scott Manley, an astrophysicist with over a million Always YouTube subscribers. The International Space Station. Scott told us over Zoom from San Francisco that what everyone saw was a Trident missile fired from a submarine somewhere in the Atlantic. It was far away and it got really high. That was the thing. I, I'm not sure exactly how close to the coast it was. Manley says while there were posted warnings about the missile test a day before for planes and boats to stay clear, there is still a mystery. Now we don't know who was testing it, which is interesting because we've previously seen a launch from there. Uh, Trident is operated by Britain and the US. And the last time a, a Trident was tested from that part was a British submarine. Manley says the launch right after sunset also created a sight that could hardly be missed in the sky, even if some still had doubts about it being a missile. That's not very believable, so it just makes me wonder. Trident missiles can travel far, about 7,000 miles, but so far there's been no official confirmation from the U.S. or British navies about any missile test. In West Palm Beach, Matt Sesney, WPTV, News Channel 5.